<laughs> so, what up, world? It's your boy BA for Real 100 and welcome to Get Your Bars Up. Media salute, salute, salute. Ugh. So, I just got through watching this Geechee Gotti and Saga battle. <laughs> Saga did his thing. My guy went into green light. He went into green light like a room raider. He went in this room raider uh, mode or whatnot, which was super duper dope. But Geechee, though. Ah, Geechee. <laughs> Geechee did his thing in this one, y'all. I can't even front. I, uh, if I had to pick one, I'm going to have to go with Geechee. Why? I think Geechee was super creative. He started off with the beat. And he was rhyming on the beat. Then he just stopped it. And he just went in on Saga. Ah! Then he had a choking. He had like he had a choking bar where he's talking about Saga. Choking his shit. Ah! Oh, my gosh. Um, this battle was fire, y'all. This battle was fire. I liked it. To, for it to be, for it to be quarantine, uh, it was exciting to see. Uh, it was exciting to finally see something else creative, and um, without having to use too many props. My guy, my, my guy Geechee pulled out the lotion. He pulled out the lotion on Saga. Ah, he got a call from Jesus and declined it. Ah, y'all think I'm playing? If y'all don't got the smack out, then. I guess y'all can go holla at T Bull. Holla at T Bull. Holla at T Bull. He, yeah, yeah. But anyways. Um, this was uh this was very, very entertaining. I think both artists brought it. And uh yeah, they both had you can tell like I guess now in this quarantine, whatever situation that we've been in, uh some some artists are actually feeling a little bit more hungry and hungrier. And uh salute to ARP uh and rare breed because i know that they they've been a big influence on how creative these battles should be if they are videoed and uh yeah 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 this was ah like this was a goodie this was a goodie saga you did your thing but Gichi got you sir Gichi got Gichi got it got you you feel me he, he got you can't even front but anyways uh the next battle that i want to talk about is well, not really a battle, not really a battle, but they went heads up because one person was feeling sensitive, and this was uh, this was Calico and Hitman Holla. Yeah, I seen you in that, and, and Hitman, that was a prank. It was a prank. I did a video. Didn't know it was a prank. Didn't know it was a prank, but I still was spitting some real ish and giving out some game that video. But anyways, um, the way that both of these guys went back and forth in their little situation uh, was very, very interesting. They both were, uh, they both had solid, uh, solid points. You dig? But one thing that I can say is, um, Hitman, Hit Hitman is, uh, Hitman was valid, and, and I'm not saying that Calico wasn't, but Hitman was valid. How are you gonna be? Uh, how are you gonna rock with somebody like rock with my enemy and laugh at one of his jokes that's directed towards my lady? Ah! And, feel, and think that I'm not gonna feel a certain type of way. And Calico thinking that it's cool. Ah, ah, this is a man perspective. This is outside of battle rap. That's why, I, ah, and I'm not supposed to be speaking about this, but I'm gonna speak about it anyway, because this is this is what happens in life with people. You dig, you always gotta watch the people that you uh that, that you consider to be cool, be friends, all of that stuff. And uh, one thing that I can say to, to uh, on, Cal on Calico's end is, when it comes to when it comes to relationships that you got with people, if you consider them your brothers, and there are two, and uh, these are two people that you feel are close, meaning QP and, and Hitman, you, you, you're close to both of them, and they get into, one says one thing about the other, stay out of it, sir. Stay out of it. When it comes to family, stay out of it. You can go behind closed doors and talk to both of them, give them both up a call. If you feel like one is wrong, hit them up and be like, yeah, yo, man, you out of line for that, sir. Da -da 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 -da. Well, yada, yada, yada. You can say all of that to them. But for you to go comment and laugh, I would have been in my feelings too if you're supposed to be my if you're supposed to be my brethren, my hip hop brethren in this brotherhood of battle rap. Yes, 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 yes. Can't even front. But uh don't want to elaborate too much on it, but both of them had uh both of them had uh well shouts out to uh, 15 minutes of fame because where I seen it at. I guess it came from uh via Instagram uh, live. But these uh when when you have when you have family, when when people are you consider them family or whatnot, and then you consider who they beefing with family, just make sure you watch it. Just just watch, just stay out of it. Stay out of it. That's all I can truly say. 
All I can say is that'll be the best bet. You can do what you want to do. You feel me? I'm just giving my two cents of tax to the game. Just my two cents of tax to the game. You feel me? Because I owe it to the culture. But um, yeah, y'all are too big. Y'all are too big time people. Hopefully, uh, Calico and the Hitman Holla do uh, square it off. They both said they love each other afterwards. Hitman still seemed a little bit bitter. Yes, yes. But Hitman, one thing that I can say is when you pull a publicity stunt like you did, ah. Ah, anything could happen. You're opening up the doors. I know you're trying to put your lady on, trying to bring views to her channel, all of that stuff and all of that. Just know that it's going to be some backlash and it's going to probably be some backlash for some people that are close to you, unfortunately, if they are really, truly friends. But hopefully both of these brothers will work it out in, uh, in the sake of battle rap. But battle rap is not life in general. So, um, man, hopefully they squash it. But anything... Anyways, I want to transition to uh, talk about Tay Rock versus T-Top. Now, this battle right here, this battle right here, man, I'm trying to tell you. I was super duper excited about this battle back in 2017. Yes, back in 2017, I wanted this to happen. T-Top had just uh, beat uh, Sue Surf, and I was just like, yeah, yeah, I can't wait. Yeah, this, they need, Tay Rock, where you at? And at this time, um... T-Top was on the incline. He was going up. He was going up the ladder. He uh, knocked off. Uh, he knocked off Mad uh, uh, Math Hafe. Thirty them. He was doing some things, putting in some work. Um, and at this time as well, Tay Rock was number one. He was El Numero Uno for real. He was number one in URL, the face, the face of battle rap possibly. Um, but transitioning back to 2020, um, I'm not super duper excited about this battle. Um, why? Um, well, first of all, it's not going to be on a big stage with a big crowd where the energy would be crazy, possibly. And then second, second of all, it's uh, yeah, it's going to be it's going to be a quarantine battle, meaning that it's most likely going to be split screen. And I'm not saying that this can't set up a future battle, but it just doesn't have it. It's just not exciting to me at this point. At this point of time, in time, back in the day, heck yeah, I was like, yeah, yeah, hold up, man, they got to see each other. I don't know if one person was dunking the other, whatever happened. Politics, you all know how it go behind the scenes when it comes to politics. But um now, now I'm not I'm not into it. But hopefully, with that being said, I'm hoping that it's fire. I'm hoping that it's fire. And I, I'm pretty sure that it's probably gonna be one rounder, a one rounder similar to the um the other thing that dropped on caffeine, which was K Shine and um uh, K Shine and New Jersey Twerk. Uh, hope, hopefully that battle is a better back and forth. Oh, well, this battle is a better back and forth because that battle wasn't. Mm -mm, K Shine brought it, but Twerk, I, I really wasn't feeling Twerk that battle. Can't even front. Uh, but yeah, yeah, man. This uh, y'all tell me what y'all think about this battle. Uh, T Top, Tay Rock, ah, 2020 and during quarantine time. Ah, I have a feeling that they're gonna be uh they're gonna be giving us throw throwaway bars. I don't think they're gonna go. I don't think they're gonna put a lot into this. That's why. That's another reason why I'm a little skeptical about this one. But anything could happen. This could possibly be a classic. This might be one of the best quarantine battles we ever seen. Who knows? Who knows? But uh, at this point in time, um, it's gonna be an alright battle, and I'm gonna be in attendance uh, in attendance to actually watch that. I'm gonna definitely. Uh, tune into caffeine. Make sure y'all tune into caffeine. I guess it's uh, gonna be at 8 p.m. Eastern time this Friday, uh, May 7th. Um, which is, um, if you're on the West Coast like me, then it's gonna be 5 p.m. Uh, our time. But anyways, that's all I got to talk about today, man. Uh, I'm gonna probably do a, a drought episode pretty soon. Uh, shout out to Hitless uh, Hitless Battle League. Um, I, I got it's a few battles on there that I actually want to watch. Shout out to my guy LL Kuji. Um, he, he was just actually put into this, uh, he was actually put in a, a, a actual magazine, a newspaper article where they were talking about him. And, uh, yeah, that's, that's, that's a big ups to battle rap. So LL Kuji, salute you. Uh, salute to my guy, uh, Spasmatic. He keep dropping these albums, man. He keep, he really keep dropping these albums. Yes. And, uh, each album is getting better. And, uh, yeah, if y'all haven't heard, um, Man on Mars too. Yeah, 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 yeah. I might have to go. I might have to put a link to the SoundCloud to go check that out. But anyways, salute to all of y'all that's been rocking me for a minute. And uh, yeah, the drought, 
episode 44 45 i don't know i've done so many because we've been in quarantine so long but i'm gonna uh, i'm gonna uh, actually sit back and uh, watch a few battles with y'all and uh see what y'all opinions are about them but anyways this is your boy ba for real 100 this is get your bars up media if this is your first time here click that subscribe button you rock with me i rock with you and if you're out there hating just because you think i'm a new guy and you just now stumbled upon my page and i've been doing this for a minute then all I can truly say is thank you for coming and get your bars up. Salute, subscribe, all that good stuff. Y'all tell me what y'all think about this Calico and Hitman situation. Tell me what you think about this um, T-Top, uh, this T-Top and Tay Rock battle. Is it going to be fire? Is it going to be all right? Ah. And uh, tell me what you think about the Geechee Gotti and the Saga battle. I think that was actually pretty dope on both from both parties, but Gotti was something else in that. That was my favorite Gotti. Uh, so far, that's my favorite Gotti quarantine uh, battle, period. But anyways, holla at your boy. Salute.